Ziggity Zig back to the next uh, Isaac game, and as you can see, I'm slowly filling out my Polaroid on a few different realms, but that one was an accident. But we are here on uh, file one. I'll try to just keep it rather straight. Um, so uh, most recently, did kind of a poor job on Lilith. It was going well, and then yeah, things. And I've started taking uh, taking care to have a look over here on the right hand side to make sure that I'm going in the right. On, on, on the right level, and I guess, uh, yeah, because I haven't unlocked Bethany yet, or a, a Apollyon, or Jacob, so it's gotta come right back around to Isaac, who I have, I've beat Isaac with, I beat the Cathedral, um, but maybe I should try for a, um, oh dear, for a show run with Isaac, that could be fun, I mean, you never know. Oh, Bob's Curse. Okay, that's pretty cool. Free bombs. Nice. Well, hello there, sir. I'm not going to worry about that just yet because I don't have any keys. And I'm also not going to take on the boss immediately yet because I don't want to. And I want to go to the item room first because that is oftentimes the most important. Now, uh, I was thinking about it. Doubles all blue fly. Hey, that's actually not bad. Uh, but yesterday's run and two things. One, and was the thing that uh, Griff actually pointed out, was that the sound was really bad. I think I have solved a few of the sound problems I was plugged into. Basically, the short answer is I was plugged into a port of, oh my god, this wants me to have a whole bunch of bombs. Uh, my audio jack was plugged into a port that is, I guess, questionable is probably the best way of putting it. So that is theoretically fixed now. Is this a plot? Can we find some? Yeah, here we go. Are those gonna hoit me? I don't actually know. We'll blow this one open and we'll blow that one open because I have so many bombs. So we're just gonna get everything up to uh, purple hard champion. Meh, 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 meh. Nightlight. I mean, it's half price. We might as well. Let's do it. <laughs> 421. Hey, that's funny. It is <laughs> I think this uh, episode's coming out at 420. So it's the uh, it's the 420 episode. If I can maybe get one additional, and in fact the green bombs. Yep, that's on theme. Let's see how many things we can accidentally get kind of on theme right now. So far, the sort of crunk face. No, wait. What's? Am I thinking this? Right? My knowledge of pot culture is at best second. Hand. That's just kind of my my interaction with pot culture. I uh, long story short, I hung out with the pot smokers in high school, but I was not myself a marijuana enthusiast. Not that I have anything uh, against it. It was a personal choice, and honestly, it was one based on absolute fear, because it it, it came up when I was younger, and I thought that any kind of chemical influence on your body would be a sign of a loss of control and I was very very uptight wound very tightly and just thinking that losing any control over my body I would just I, it, it gave me terrible terrible vibes and feelings to think that I would lose control over over my body like that <clears throat> so I stayed away from it I was offered it very politely you know from friends of mine and they all say hey do you want to try this and I'm like no oh, not right now, no, no thank you. And they say, okay, that's really cool. And they'd stop. There was absolutely no chance for eternal hearts. Let's try for eternal hearts, that seems cool. Also, three cents for there, no, and... Where is the super secret room going to be? Do we suppose? I think it's going to be the end of this wall over here. No, it's not. It's not going to be over there. Okay, so I have... Oh, crap. I hit the wrong button. Is it over here? I think it's gonna be over here. I'm just wasting bombs left, right, and center. I got ten bombs, and I'm down to five. I'm just throwing them wherever I feel like it. Oh. Well, this is interesting. Are you guys gonna give me coins? Head of the Keeper, maybe? That would be really awesome if I could get some additional... No. Nothing. Ooh. That was okay, though. Can you... I need to send... I need some coins. There we go. So, yeah, blowing these guys up for a little bit more money, because then that can get me the red heart that's sitting over there. Uh, let's see. Did I blow up the guy in here? Because five, taking five cents down to the next floor. Ow, man. Is my wish. 
I could blow this up. Yeah, we're gonna blow it up. Okay. And get a couple of coins out of it. So I got five cents to go down to the next floor with my... Uh, and that'll be the chance for the arcade. Ooh, and I've also got an additional key. Oh, man. I hate these things. No! That's more like it. What you got? Okay, so I just got my bombs back. That's fine. Whatever. Whatever. <laughs> Get out of the way of these spikes. Okay, cool. I hate gurglings, especially in a room where they don't give me the entirety of the room to evade stuff in. So, I think we're going to take a little bit of damage here. I was not expecting to take damage against the actual flies. Oh, gurglings are the worst. I hate these guys. I think I've mentioned them. I don't even have a way to get myself out of this. Um, oh, yeah, I think the random directions. This is going up against the, the the smaller guy from Gemini, just time after time after time, like a Tina Turner song. No wait, Cindy Lauper. Wait, who did time after time? Well, now I can't remember. And it was either. I don't think it was Tina Turner. I think it was Cindy Lauper. And even then, was it a cover song? Oh man, now I'm questioning everything. That's really cool. The uh, the soul heart there is quite a good pickup because that means that I can get hit on the next floor, which is invariably going to happen because I don't quite have the damage yet to do really well here. That was my dipsy doodle. I managed to stay low enough so that the guy wouldn't follow me around the corner, so I'm actually pretty proud of that one. There's no keys, but... This is availability be a, 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 inevitability of death. Uh, not sure inevitability of death to death just a little bit. Uh, but this is, is uh, going to be kind of a tricky one. This was a really awesome room because everyone kind of killed themselves on the fires. I would like some more flambes out of the arcade. Is that? No, that's not going to be it at all. Okay, cool. Ooh, this might be my secret room to the north there. Right, I was trying to describe how I evaded the, the sneaky, sneaky doodles. I think I was saying in the, in the last episode that I need to learn the names of most of these enemies because I don't actually know what everything is called. That wasn't it either? Dang. Dang to dang. Dang dang. But I do need some keys. So, I don't know what we're gonna do if I can't find keys on this floor because well, I mean, I do know what we're going to do. We're going to just run the heck out of here and not get a chance at the shop. I have tried getting into the shop via secret room bays. Um, this could be it, and if it's not, then I at least get a bomb. Oh, darn. So at least I get the bomb. Cool. Oh, here we go. There's some keys. That's what we're talking about. Can't really do much with that, pardon me, for the beer pays. We have 11 cents, so honestly, I think I'm going to go into the shop with the first key because sometimes you get a chance at a... Ooh, hello, chaos. Tempting. Active volts don't charge, they charge by de uh, by defeating enemies. That's kind of good, but only on something that has like either a, a big... A, a six-room charge, you get better there, but a one-room charge, you do not. So it all depends... If, if I'm planning on getting a space bar out of any of this. Hey, boys. Hey, look at me. I'm, I'm, avi I'm avi avoiding. I'm avoiding. I'm avoiding all the all the damage that you got on there. That's ah, happy for... <laughs> this is what you say in your happy, happy 420. That'd be craft brew... No, not craft brew day, but definitely dark beer or some kind of... You know, beer and a potato day? No, that's... <laughs> that's racist or xenophobic. I don't know. I can't even tell. I read... Uh, and it's 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 not that I'm trying to avoid saying that there's racism. There is definitely racism, but calling things the way they are. I'm a stickler for grammar, and that's you know this is that sort of check my privilege immediately right there, which is what is the worst problem I've ever had? You know what are what are some of my hardships as a white cis male? Is uh, you know when someone says the wrong word <laughs> grammatically, boy that really chafes me. So that's that's the worst hardships I've ever had. You know I grew up in a junior high where people say the sentence oh and this 
I seen him the other day. This is, this is the worst of my trauma, is, is, is that kind of thing happening. So I didn't go through, you know, refugee camps or anything like that, or persecution, or being, you know, tortured, uh, targeted by an active police force, things like that. I have bad grammar, so that's my problem. My problem is with bad grammar. So the question is, if you say something is racist, and if we have what's known as the human race, then aren't we all theoretically one race? And is that what people are sort of saying? Now, the problem there is that this is people who then say, yeah, you know, all humans are the same thing, so there's no such thing as racism, so I should be able to call the darkies anything I want. And that, that is a slippery slope. <laughs> that, that is uh, the kind of argument that I don't want to get into. So I'm like, no, no, you shouldn't be allowed to do that. That's terrible. So what I'd much rather do is say things like, mm, is this is, is this grammatically correct to say that it's race, racist? You know, I'm still going to call racist out for being racist for saying things like, I should be able to call the darkies anything I want. There we go. We got a good shoop to whoop shot into Plum right away, but honestly, it's going to come down to the fact that, oh, I walked right into that one and I didn't want to. Dude, Plum, 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 So I'm going to try to remember. Oh, no. There goes my 99% chance. Stupid Plum. I just, yeah, I, I don't have the... Oh, my God. I do not have the damage. I do not have the anything. This has not gone exactly the way that I wanted it to. As I often say, the point to this game is to survive long enough. Okay, and that was immediately really bad. Survive long enough to become extremely powerful. It's the uh, the Joseph Stalin story. <laughs> Just forget I said that. And that's that's all there is to this game. Just survive, survive long enough, get powerful. I wasn't. I don't feel like I was powerful enough yet. What is going on? I'm getting chimes. Watch out for the, the Quasimodo. The bells! The bells! I really came close to hitting them spikes. Oh, good. This is going to be one of those runs. So, is it going to be a run where I'm lacking keys? Or is it going to be a run where I'm lacking in a box? I mean, you tell me. That's where it's at. Would have liked to have put some money back in my donation machine, but there's the thing. On 420, I... I decided that uh, 421 was the wrong amount of coins to be in my donation machine, and I removed them. So that's where we're at there. I'm not a boy. Uh, okay, well, that's actually not the worst thing in the world. Ooh, that's pretty sweet. I'll take that. Is there a secret room down here? No. Is there a secret room up here? No again. I'll blow this guy up, because you never know, he might... He might, uh, result in a consumable... He didn't. So we're on low. There's no secret room in and around that particular curse room, which really sucks, which means I'm out several bombs and also out uh, several bits of heart. So let's try to get those back. Hey, there's my two bombs back. Sweet. We only have two cents, which is not amazing, but... Oy. Oy, 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 It could be here. Yeah, there we go. Finally found the secret room. Nice. And we get this Necronomicon for our troubles, which is... It's not absolute worst in lieu of any other amounts of uh, items or especially, yeah, definitely no spacebar, spacebar item doth I have. Actually, let's do it. There you go, got them all. Um, could have been better. Oh, I thought I was going to get something out of the pot. Could have been better to leave that for the boss room here, but I don't know. It's a room full of flies. That's what I wanted to do. Oh, and it's just it's just Larry. Larry with a magician card, because the main problem with uh, fighting Larry is that he moves too fast for any of your shots to actually hit him. So a little bit of homing tears does a body good. 
Um, eat your Wheaties. Good, good, whole wheat tray. Something, something, something. I don't know why I'm shooting so many poops right now, but I'm kind of, for some reason, aiming for the poops and not actually aiming at Larry Jr. at all. One of the things that I was thinking of recently is that most of my, ooh, spirit, speed and damage is real cool, other than a potential for a super secret room. <sighs> there is nothing up here that I want to go for anymore. I was thinking, once again, about the number of runs it's going to take me to actually get anywhere here in Isaac. That really sucks. But at least it did not affect my deal with the devil chances. Kind of impressed that that didn't take more damage. Is... So, yeah, concerning the Lilith run, where, you know, I'm trying to... I'm trying to get six wins of the Cathedral... And I just, I keep dying, especially when we come down close to it on the womb, because we're taking double damage down there, and I, I'm not dodging enough, I'm not playing well enough, and it's really starting to absolutely 100% show. Oh dear. Okay, yeah, speaking of, there it is. He's already taking, taking damage on him. <clears throat> Can you take care of this there in Smart Fly, please? I'm not going to <clears throat> worry about that so hard at the moment, because I've already taken... The red heart damage on this floor, so I'm going to save that as a insurance for these next floor that I will inevitably also be trying not to take red heart damage on. But yeah, it's um, I am doing a lot of of Isaac runs, and I keep dying where. You, you want to be going on a streak, and you want to, you know, if, if I need six Isaac kills, you want to do that in six runs in a row. But the problem is, is that, one, I'm not very good at each of the characters. Oh, Play-Doh <laughs> It's not the best. It's not terrible, but it's not the best. Also, Growth Hornimos is honestly the best thing we've got going for us right now. It, but, so some of these are like, I don't know, sometimes there's charge, not charge, but uh, charm tiers, and sometimes there's, you know, fire tiers, sometimes there's ice tiers. It's just a, uh, it's just a roundhouse, roundhouse wheelhouse. Four check, back check, pay check, buddy. Um, okay. Continue, try to finish my thought on the number of runs that I'm doing. And it comes down to the fact that I just keep doing it purely. And so it's going to take a very, very long time to clear this, um, to clear this game. I'm trying to get wins with everybody, and even just getting myself... Do I have anything here that's any good? No, not tremendously. You, I want to blow up, because then I get to up. Ooh, actually, donation machine will help me out, I think, but no, I need 10 cents for the donation machine for that to work. Maybe, let's just check it in. Darn it, yeah, I, need, I do need 10 cents. Um, did I find... Oh, I don't have any bombs left. Why don't I have any bombs left? Oh, right, because this is a different game. Ugh. I was trying to do the math on it, in fact, because there are 17 characters, okay, and there are... How many post-it marks? 10 post-it marks, so that's 170 uh, game defeats, or, yeah, beating, beating the game. 170 runs right there, and then there's all the challenge runs, of which there are about, I don't know, 50. Um, and then there's also the the number of greed modes that you gotta do, and that's a total crapshoot, mostly because <coughs> um, some sometimes you can put in like 2 cents, sometimes you can put in 90 cents. It was kind of annoying. We did that greed run last week, and I was only able to, you know, I had like 70 coins, and I only got to put in, I think, six or something tiny like that. Still on a 49% chance to deal with the devil. That's actually pretty sweet. So this will hopefully allow me to get it. It did not give me the thing. Man, that really, ooh, really sucks. What you got? Oh, amnesia. Well, I don't really need it right now, but I am going to go back and get... Is that it? No. Get a number of those. So, we are in for the long haul. There is going to be an awful lot of Isaac episodes for me to 100% clear, and it's going to be a long way to the top if you want to rock and roll. Uh, did, was there a... Nope. Why was that so hard? It was like up here at the very top? There it is. 
That's my treasure chest room. We got all that. Mm, I don't have any bones, so I can't even check for secret rooms, so honestly, we might as well just get out of here. My voice is still not quite back to 100%. I'm feeling much, much better, but still feeling just a little bit croaky. So, the honestly, the thing that it's making me think about right now is the fact that I have to op host an open mic night this week. I'm finally back to my open mic night where I... <clears throat> Caves XL. This is pure. Um... So what I'm trying to decide right now is whether or not to use the Emperor card to go straight to the boss, which means that I have the best chance at the deal with the devil, or do I try to fight and take my chances? Oh god, I probably should have Emperor, shouldn't I? Yep. Because here we go. I'm gonna lose out on a bunch of these. Oh, my, my damage is better than I thought it was. Yay! Cool. Yay! Not fantastic. So, I, I already take, took a one single hit of damage, which means that if I go straight to the boss room now, I will only have two hits of damage. <laughs> or, you know, one. Oh, please be bad, Trip. There we go. Oh, it's a lock up. That's not bad, actually. Mmm... Sack room is cool. The 100% deal with the devil chance is is great, but am I going to completely forsake that very, 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 very soon? Let's do it. Oh no, a double tingle is not good. <laughs> this is about the absolute worst that we could have got, honestly. Oh, and holy cow! Okay, yep, and he hit me. I didn't even see him charging. Okay, well, it was a gamble. It was a 100% gamble. I'm still gonna try to avoid... A little bit of additional damage. Oh dear, took another one right there. Just to prove that I might be able to solve this room and exist in here. Because these guys, they only do one charge. It's not like the three in the row of the other dudes. Well, there's eye drops. Okay, so, now, the other part of it is, if I head, if I headed straight for the deal with the devil, there is a chance that I could go back. And I thought, maybe, maybe there will be joker cards. You never know. Oh. I had to destroy the other one, too. Well, there's a 36% chance to deal with the devil, so... What else? Ouch! I really didn't think that was gonna hit me from there. I hate these guys, because I can't see... I'm not very good at telling when the... Uh, at telling tier height, so when the attacks are coming in on the huge lob. Those are the ones that I really don't enjoy. Are you, uh, do you guys shoot? tears at me at all? You do that kind of thing? Are you into that? Just, you know, let me know what you're into. And we can, we can sit down, we can talk. It'll be a good time. Oh, flooded caves, flooded caves. Dude! I can't believe that hit me. Well, actually, yes, I can. I think I want to check for a secret room right here. Oh, I only have one bomb. What am I doing? What am I doing? I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. I don't know what I'm doing. Frozen where I stand. Took you by the hand. That, okay, now uh, we're learning for Open Mic Night tonight that I am not doing that great for my high notes. So it might be uh, kind of a low. A low note kind of thing. We gotta get down here into the country music. You know, we're going 90 miles an hour down a dead end street. There we go. There's that's that's versatility. That's uh, that's range is what we got right there. But uh, the only reason we got range is because we're sick. So <laughs> not taking care of yourself is the best way to get better. There you go. You heard it here first, kids. You can write that on a t-shirt, unless you don't want to write it on a t-shirt, unless what you really want to do 
is wait until someone else puts it on a t-shirt and then take credit for it and sue them for doing all the work. Works for me. I'll take it. Oh my god. These rooms are just brutal. Honestly, Necronomicon is saving my butt. Hey, guy. I'm a little excited about the Yera rune, to be honest. Oh, well, shot speed up's pretty cool. Uh-huh, 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 uh-huh. Uh, except I'm also being trickled away ever so slightly. My 519 damage is feeling pretty cool. What do you got for me? Health up hill is all right, so that means it's it's definitely not a health down hill. Because if it was a health down, some sometimes when you when you get a health down pill and you only have one heart, then it turns into a health up. So that's why you get lulled into a false sense of security, thinking that all your health pills are health up pills when in fact they are not. So at three hearts full, three hearts full, you gain. Oh, okay, <laughs> I thought that was going to turn into some spawn and do some amazing things. Here we go. I have no money. Why do I have no money? I'll tell you why I have no money. I'm going to blow this up. And then we're going to Yera. There we go. That got some action from the back section. The issue here... And a two of... Oh, two of clubs is for bombs. This will not get me two. Oh, it will get me two. Sweet. Five will get you ten. Get up in there. That gives me another ten percent. Oh, darn it. I bought another two of clubs. Well, that's cool. Whatever. <clears throat> I'd love to blow that open. Oh. What? I hate these guys so much. They've killed me so many times. Why am I not getting any red hearts either? That's frustrating. Oh dear. This is gonna kill me. This is gonna kill me! I'm not dead yet. Somehow. Okay, you're gonna blow this up. And then you're gonna give me lots of bombs. Ready? One, two, three, go. <laughs> I'm so fast, at least. Oh my god. I could die. I could die in the item room. I don't wanna die in an item room. <sighs> Backstabber gets me health back. Oh, wait a minute. There. Blow it up. Cool. Now, did that explode my donation machine? Or... It did. It did explode my donation machine, but on the bright side, I'm going to pick this up. Yeah, it's going to have exactly the same stuff it had in it before. The deck of cards is kind of cool. Uh, a six charge item for deck of cards, but what if, what if, and hear me out, I don't take deck of cards and I keep dealing with Necronomicon because it's actually a little bit of damage. You know what? No, that's a terrible idea because every now and then I might be able to get something good out of the deck of cards, like a two of hearts. There you go, Pilgrim. Two of hearts. That only duplicated a small amount, but... It feels like that's better for... Are you kidding me? Oh, right. <laughs> Look at this weird room. That's nuts. I don't know how to, how to process that. I don't have any bombs right now to look for the secret room. Anyway, what's... Uh... Oh. Oh. Yeah, that's bad. That's pure. But... Oh, here we go. Second item room. That's right. I don't get that many XL floors. This is not really that many astounding things. I am rocking a good amount of speed right now, which I'm pleased about. Chance to fire backwards. That's not fantastically amazing. Could you uh, hit him up with a few more pyro shots here? I love it when they catch fire. Fire. There. Okay. Get that guy from a distance, because also I'm kind of pleased at my ranged. Spawn one fly when getting hit. Fish head is not bad. Oh, it's these guys. I only have a couple more rooms left for potential recharge ability. There's going to be nothing right there. I can't get that. 
Yeah, I'm literally on my last... My last room. For recharges. Now come on. Because I thought... Oh no, the backstab does... It continues to do more damage. I thought backstab was the one where it heals you when you do damage to it, but no, I think I'm getting it quite wrong. I'm excited about Gertie Jr. I would love for the attack fly to do some damage, but he only does damage once I've taken a little bit of damage. 46% chance to deal with the devil is the second time I've had it as a near 50 deal with the devil chance, and I don't feel like I'm going to get it again. That's getting annoying. Oh, good, and another, <laughs> another speed up. Well, we're at maximum speed. Great. And we got six cents. Oh, right, because I bought the, the deck of cards. I could have gone back and gone into the, the curse room, but that would have taken away yet again my my soul heart, which is the only thing giving me the chance that I deal with the devil right now. I'm still, at, I feel like this um, this damage is doing better at every floor because right now it's only. Oh, actually, you know what it is. You know what it is. Ooh, there's a health up. That's nice. And a question mark, which is oh good, pretty fly. I'll take that. Is this? Anyway, let's get a card. Justice. Let's uh, pop the justice. Get moving. I think this is the secret room. I'm wrong. Great. Moving on. <laughs> I'll, I'll accept my losses and get out of here. Oh no. Oh no. 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 You're gonna attack me all with stupid little lies. Boy, I'd like to go and get that. Familiar, stay closer to you. Mm, not amazing. Gotta tell you, it's not hugely beneficial. Okay, let's see if I can get these guys first. Oh, I got you on the right side of the room. Nice. Uh, why I didn't take damage on that other room, I have no idea. Come on, something. Speed, great. Damage multiplier. Penalty shrinks as you get damage ups from other items. It's a 38% negative. So that's not good. It's It'd be great if it was for, like, speed and that, but... I'm not... It's not going to be speedy for me. Oh, this room. You know what this room would have been great in this room? Is the Necronomicon <laughs> would have been pretty sweet in here. Oh, why did I go this way? How am I supposed to live without you? Alright. You know how I was saying that my damage was uh, doing really good? Um, now I, I want to take all that back because I think my damage is terrible. But at least I'm feeling a little bit better at dodging? Kind of. Alright, this guy's just launching flies everywhere. I gotta get rid of you. Uh, I can take those two out. I don't know why he hasn't exploded yet. I've hit him like 800 times. There. How hard was that? It's easy. Oh, ghosts. Ghosts are the worst. Ooh. I backstabbed him. Where'd you go, backstabby? Backstabby McGee! Dang it, there it goes again. Alright, so I'm not getting any deals with the devil here because apparently a 49% chance is not good enough. Which, you know, I can kind of agree to. There, suck it. Hermit cards! Yes, please. Probably should have waited, but whatever. I'm gonna blow you up. Ah, oh, man. Uh, no bombs. Spider... Spider mod is good. Why did I do that? Mm, more utility than anything else. Not quite as useful as you'd think. Okay. This will give me a couple of charges. Again, damage... I think it, the damage depends on the Play-Doh shot. Because I've got a number of different Play-Doh shots that I can use. 
This one just sprawls, doesn't it? They're all over the place. Dude, buddy's bite. Wow. Why are these guys so hard to hit suddenly? Tears getting caught in like the cobwebs or something? They are, they're getting caught on the cobwebs. Who allowed that to happen? Okay, so, once again, once again with a 46% chance to deal with the devil. Two of spades. Yes, please! That duplicated a lot of keys. Boom. Um... Oh. Well, you can actually get them lined up in, in a row. Things get much easier to deal with. I'm gonna get a spare bomb. And then I'm gonna blow this up with one of my bombs. Kablam! What's that? This nameless. This is drop a copy of the pill card. Uh, you know what? Because I've got the card box, that actually probably works quite well. I don't know what that one is like. Oh dear. Can you stop any of that? No, there's no button. That sucks. Ow. Go, yellow fly. You're my only savior. Just one single coin in almost all of these rooms. I'm getting pretty mad. What else can I do? I can go to the Kois room. And I think I might, honestly. And that's why you do. Come for the guppy items. Stay for the guppy items. Hello, sir. And blow you up. And I'm glad I did. I'm not gonna take that. I'm gonna take a little bit more damage. What was what was the item in the item in the Whatever it was was something I did not want. Um, there's your fish heads. Eat them up, yum. Mm, okay, so 20 cents. That'll get me the mod, buddy. Which isn't damage per se. But it's still pretty cool. I like mod, buddy. Did I blow up the guy? I feel like this is as good as my... Um, my percentage at a deal with the devil is going to get. So we have, on a nearly 50-50 chance, I have failed twice in a row. No, wait, this is the third time in a row? This could be three in a row. There it is, three in a row. Unidentified pill. Take them all, paralysis, sure. What's this one? It makes you larger, pretty fly. Another one makes me larger. So now I'm big, I'm still fast, but I'm big. <sighs> Do I go back and I try to get anything? No, because the blood bag will only get me faster and I'm already fast enough. The IV bag is meh. All right. So now we're downstairs and nearly ready for the mob fight. This is awful. I hate this room. Ooh. Oh, triple yikes. Come on. Got him. Holy cow, I managed to find the sweet spot. It was the uh, the eighth pie slice in there. Okay, what do you got? What do you got? I mean... The 2.0... With 2.0 luck, there is a mild chance. <laughs> nope, and there it goes again. Why are these yellow flies absolutely devastating me today? I don't know what it is. Somehow they're doing crazy damage to me. I don't know what do we got. What kind of nonsense room is this. I don't like it, I don't like it, I don't like it, I don't like it, I don't like it. This is, this is brutal. You gotta stay on the spikes the entire way around. 
No, thank you, sir. I don't feel like dancing. No, sir, no dancing today. For real? And... Okay, well, did see the, um... The item room was over on the other side. I have never seen that room before. It's like some kind of awful conveyor belt. Okay, just gotta survive a little bit longer. Just, honestly, I was really hoping that the, uh, the card box was gonna get me... Like... Some useful cards. I don't know, some Joker cards, this and that. But no, no, it's not. I mean, also, I'm not avoiding things fast enough and I'm eventually taking... There's a moon card, cool. There's an empress card, cool. And there is a magician card. Alright, so we moon card first. Get out of here. Oh. Well, that didn't work quite as well as I wanted it to. But on the bright side, brought me back up here to the item room, in which case. <laughs> We're back to Fox. <laughs> Great. That's fantastic. We're back to the Bob's Curse. Unidentified pill. Taking all the pills. Yay! Pills are finally working out for me. You know the run is bad when the only thing saving you is the pills. <clears throat> so... Magician, no. Empress, yes. I will take damage over homing tears. Thank you, please. Whoop, speaking of. Five cents. Humbling bundle would be really good. There's another 10%. Got me back up to the 46% chance. Yeah. I would love, 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 love. I don't want the vibrant bulb. The dim bulb is honestly the best. That was some pretty good evasion. Made it through that. Okay, what do you got? 48 hour energy. Yas, please. Hierophant. Yas, please. Pop it again. World card. You know what? Let's keep the Empress. Uh, and take and try to take the world card with me. Laytorbs. Why? Do those continue to exist? Uh, but the problem there... Hmm... Is that I need to use then the Empress card somewhere on this floor before we get out of here. So I'll just take it with me for now. Huh. How would I get back out of this? I don't feel like I want to fight with that right now. Oh, here's this machine. Right, right, right. The machine that I put there. Right. The poison. The poison for Cusco. The poison chosen specifically to kill Cusco. Cusco's poison. Here's one for you. Oh, wait, no. It's Empress. We're gonna do it. There's no point to holding on to the Empress to carve anything else. I am kind of excited about the arcade, honestly. That's a pretty cool find. What do we... What? <laughs> this is terrible. There. That's kind of cool. And honestly, yeah, get out. I don't care. Look at that. Now we're rocking. Now we're doing a little bit better. Okay, so we can finally start maybe potentially landing on some deals with the devil because I finally have a little bit of room with my, uh, with my health. If I'm just getting a bunch of health. There is an hermit card, which is curious. Given... Did I go through there? I think I got the curse room already. Was that the one where I got Guppy's head? Oh, hi, Rath. So, Wrath, if you could... Yeah, here we go. If you could... Do a little something, something for me. That'd be amazing. Mm, 
do have des bombs. Did I go through? I did not go through. All right, well, let's go through the GB way. Aha! And we got a free heart out of it. Sweet! I wanted to take the world card with me, which might be... No, that's the magician card. It's up here somewhere. It's not far. Oh! It's down here by the end boss, which is where I wanted to be. See how that worked out? <laughs> oh, Jesus. Stupid mom's foot. Oh, it's the red foot. Is it the red foot? No. What? Where's the finger? They don't usually fit quite that far out. Why is my damage pretty darn terrible? 5.1. This is... Stop shooting exactly where I am every time. Just keep moving, keep moving. That's the problem. I'm holding too still is the main problem there. I would love to have something that's a little bit more uh, damaging, like an orbital in my basic surroundings. Oh, here we go. Now we're talking. You managed to get a, an Empress card out of it. That's that's pumped up my damage slightly. Way to, to jump right into that bit of damage. Holy cow. I'm, I'm going to use every single one of my soul hearts on this mom fight, and that's embarrassing. Because I can defeat this. I can do a mom fight. It's no problem. Stop ringing them bells at me. And I keep worrying about getting poked by the um, by the fingers coming out of the bottom one. And oh my god. Do you think... I think I've, I think I've lost five... We're now up to like five or six hearts. On this one fight. And I'm not gonna get the deal with the devil, and even if I do, I don't think it's gonna have a devil. Oh no, it is gonna have a devil item in it. Stop it! Okay, this is this is embarrassing. It's absolutely embarrassing. That was terrible. Alrighty, what do we got? We've got the two of clubs. Uh, the Two of Diamonds. I think I'd love to hold on to that, but honestly, no, because we want the world card going down, so lovers. The lovers. We gotcha. Um, Hierophant. Lovely. Hierophant. World. World. Clubs. Diamonds. Taking the world with me. I can't believe that we're still not getting it. Zero. Zero deals with the devil or angel because I just can't keep myself in any form of damage. All right, so we've got the secret room is just over there, which I will use first. Let's see a little bit of mapping. Ugh. Can't believe how terrible my damage is though. So we gotta survive through the boss and hope to get something really good out of the deal with the devil because at this point, it's not worth trying to wait to not get the deal with the devil. Oh, this is the full on dingle, isn't it? Die. 519. I was proud of this damage a really long set of floors ago. Nice that it, um, yeah, the spider mod also tells you how many, how much health is left on these little dig, diglet guys. What you got? Stars card. Not handy. I'll just wait for everyone to slowly show up. Should be fine. Lucky Toe. Extra pickups from machines and whatnot. The doubling of the card, 25% chance to drop a copy of it. That has not been happening for me. I'm gonna get rid of this guy because uh, they drop all the creep that I will eventually then fall upon. Luckily, uh, I don't have very complicated tiers right now for me to get confused as to who's shooting who with what. Oh, no. Okay. There she is. Oh, there she goes. I 
think that's all the hands from above. Hand of Fate. What are they called? They're called something. Wish they had a much. I think they have a pretty cool name. Pretty fly is all right. I've got a stars card. This will help me out. So now all I gotta do is try to. Okay, I can't defeat Skolex without taking three hits of damage. Although I gotta kill these guys first. Let's get rid of the little numpties. The numpties. Wow. You jerk. Okay, a little bit of damage there, a little bit of damage there, 1.5, what are you talking about? I need him to stick his butt up in the air, that did the most damage that I can protect. Oh, we got him down to about halfway, okay, here we go. So, some of those fire shots are actually getting in there. Honestly, I think the Play-Doh cookie is doing some of my best damage. What else has been a huge help? The pretty, f the um, the happy fly has been really good to me. Uh, what else has been really good? I think we'll take in the HP with me. Oh. Nice. Kind of a low tier rate, but it's good damage and it's piercing. So we'll take it. I think I only unlocked Death's Touch on one of them. Not too, uh, not all that long ago. This is a bunch of complete nonsense, so we're gonna blow it all up. Give me some coins. I could theoretically. Missing page. Nah, it's not good. I, I could have maybe, maybe done a little bit more with it, but... Standing there and gambling only with it like a, I think I'm on a 2.0, ah, 3.0 for gambling. Ooh, easy, 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 easy. Do 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 do. What is this? Pop your head up and stop being a jerk. What is like being completely impenetrable for the longest amount of the of the level? That's just unfair. Shot speed up is. It's actually kind of cool. Shot speed up. Boom. There they go. Okay. Okay. Live long enough to get carried. That's what we got going on. And a moon card, taking it. Um, that didn't blow anybody up. Death card? Why didn't it blow anybody up? Well, that's stupid. Get the chub. I was tempted to use my death card because it was a big room, but I think the sound of these sides, it, it sounds like really weird mechanical clockwork or something. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Don't I have piercing shots? Oh, they're not spectral just yet. There's your problem. <clears throat> Where am I going? I don't honestly know. Uh, the answer? Not this direction, because this direction is the wrong way. So, I guess we pop up through here. Ouch! You slimy juice. So, we're still not really rocking up full capacity. The Play-Doh and Death's Touch is kind of cool. I do keep taking way too much damage is a bit of a problem. What do you got? Judgment is Judgment. curious. I have 21 cents, so let's do it. Come on, give me something good. Give me a couple of hearts and then a nice juicy health up, please, would be good. That is not a heart. Keep at it, though. Keep me going. Come on. I will get a higher deal with the devil chance if I blow you up, but I don't realistically want to... Are you serious? All of that. All of that for the Butterbean. Butterbean is the worst. Well, if I take one more hit of damage, I can go... Wait a minute. If I, I've been to the arcade. There's nothing left because I blew it all up. My voice <clears throat> is given out. Gonna death card mostly because I hate gurglings. And if I don't, 
probably gonna die from to these guys. Oh man. <coughs> Ooh. They jump, they jump, they jump, they jump. They jump and I die. They jump and I die. That sucked. I got I finally did get Death's Touch, but I can't believe I made four floors with only a 50% chance to with the devil. It was up to me from, from uh, taking damage, but again, this is, uh, this is what it's going to take forever. It's going to take forever because it's just going to take long enough for me to learn how to dodge everything properly. Leave me a comment down below. Send me an email. Ziggy, ziggy, gmail.com. You can follow me on Twitter. Ziggy, zig. See ya.